so here's our 3,112 miles to our guy over here standing on the East Coast, right? And he sees the sun at a 45 degree angle. For those of you who forgot trigonometry or never learned it, this little mark thing here indicates this is a 90 degree. Okay, now, granted, if the Earth is curved, this is going to be much down farther than this, isn't it? Okay, and that's going to work out to the disadvantage of people, so keep that in mind. All right, what I'm going to prove here, that's going to be to your disadvantage if you're going to say, well, the Earth is curved, so this, this is farther down. Okay, fine. You want to have that, you're going to make it worse for yourself. I'm proving here that the, the sun is no way it's 93 million miles above the, the Earth. Cannot be. Mathematically, cannot be. You got that, people? Cannot be. Here's why. This is the Pythagorean theorem. All right? A squared plus B squared equals C squared. Here's side A. Here's side B. Here's side C. When you take 93 million miles and 3,112 miles, you square them up. Square root of that is 93 million point zero five miles. Those that know trig and math already see the problem here, but we'll get to it. All right. So the hypotenuse, which is line C here, is 93 million point zero five miles. There was a lot more decimal points, but it ain't going to matter. All right. It's almost as far as the sun is above this guy out here in California is the hypotenuse. Okay, the trig people are like, oh my God, the Earth, the, the sun's nowhere near 93 million miles away because they realize it already. <laughs> this is beautiful, folks. Tell me the math is wrong here. That's the only thing that's going to dismiss this. So, Mr. 3,112 miles away sees the sun at a 45 degree angle. No doubt about it. It's halfway between noon and sunset, correct? From his vantage point, 45 degree angle in the sky. It sets three hours later total of six hours difference a guy another 3,112 miles over it's sunset time 6 p.m. okay it's flat on the horizon but we want to find out we found out what the hypotenuse was now does this work okay here's the problem with this guys this is not to scale okay 93 million miles this way I've got as roughly the same as 3,112 miles this way Okay, <laughs> wait till we see it to scale. Just a moment, if I can get this thing to work on me, for me here. Guys, this is still not the scale, uh, not even close. Um, <laughs> all right, 93 million miles up this way would be the sun. The angle would be so straight up and down for the guy 3,112 miles away I doubt it would even be one degree I'm just showing some separation here just for you it's 93 million miles up versus 3,112 miles and I did the calculation what was the freaking ratio you're not gonna believe this um, doesn't matter it was <laughs> it was unbelievable something I couldn't draw on here it was actually almost it was 90 some million to one was the ratio um, 90 this would have to be 93 <laughs> uh, let's say 90 million uh, units higher than this is wide here all right so if you think that that's the case and somebody actually who knows the trig I'd like to know what would be the degree here I guess you have to use what is a sine of theta or I don't know I don't remember so anyway uh, if you can figure out uh, 3,112 miles versus 93 million miles up, what the angle would be also, I'm interested what the hypothesis would be, uh, hypotenuse would be. More importantly, you guys can figure this out. What would side B be? A, 93 million miles. B, you could tell from the other things because you have two of the three figures uh, what it would be. But uh, this is why the sun is not 93 million miles away because... The guy on the Earth would have to be 90 million miles away just to get close to a 45 degree angle, okay? And that can't be done anywhere on the Earth. I hope that's clear. The math makes it clear. The Earth makes it clear, okay? If you're here and it's 12 noon, you have to be about 90 million miles over here for you to be able to see the sun at a 45 degree angle, okay? It doesn't work, and no one has ever come up with this. I, I mean, I'm sure people have come up with it, but people want to believe the lie. 